Greetings everyone, this is Dose with Dose Review. Right now I want to unbox the M8XAR15 by Furman. If you're new here, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also turn on notifications for more videos. Okay, this is actually the Furman box. It's actually uh, one of the most special unboxings that I have done for a really long time. Actually, I wanted this item for ages now. So now here I have it, the M8XAR15, because it has a number in the back also. And the firm is made in Magwell Boulevard in California. This is my knife now. I'm actually gonna unbox this from the middle. We're gonna give it a, a roll up like this on the one on the left and also on the right. Okay, uh, this is actually the, the box and I wanted to do this for a while now so I'm a really excited person actually right now like in a candy store. And now this is it. Actually, it is a power solution. It has a microprocessor engineer and voltage regulation with 120 back and also noise filtering system also for electromagnetic interfaces with spike and search and nine outlets, one in the front and one in the back, 15 amp rating and power status indication LED lights in the front. Also has a 15 and also a regulator of uh, 15 amp. The cost actually is $679.99 and in, in your retail source actually the back of the box right here and tell you what it is mostly for recording, for instrumentals, for DJ equipment, for recording studios and audio production mostly. Anywhere you can be able to place this to have a minimum of protection on your audio gear. Okay, it has a voltage regulation, a noise frustration, surge protection, nine outlets, one in the back also, a 15 amp rating, and dynastic light. Okay, this is actually my unboxing that I've been looking for a really long time. So this is how the box uh, looks like from the ferment. It also comes with this, uh, I think what is this? Yeah, instruction manual. This is actually one of the good instruction manuals, really good. One of the best I've seen so far. Comes with all this plastic with uh, this phone on the side to give actually better protection on the condenser also comes with this uh, rack right here I don't know what it really does but I have to like know and when I put it together I'll be letting the guys know what what really does it's actually the rack for the, on the sizes for sure pretty much okay um, so let's move on this is actually the unboxing I actually got a, a uh, glove because the this condenser on top of it leaves a lot of fingerprints so also comes with this very nice thing and as you can see I'm not I'm not gonna about to put my all my fingerprints on this uh, ferment so actually it has a holes right here for the rack because it's a rock mount and it's really durable everything is metal metal it's a low EVS with a hundred to uh, 135 incoming voltage we need regulation with high EDS with has the OK button the yellow limiter and also the red not okay so you have to look all of that when I turn it on I'm actually gonna show you how it is in the ex extreme current because that's why you want to look forward when you have a uh, great gear with your 120 volt it's actually the plug is 15 also 120 and this is uh, the amp outage reset for the turn on button and off on the side so this is the logo on the right also to indicate which one is the one that you have from the ferment it, this actually comes out but I don't I cannot show you because we don't have an outage everything else is really well made and not frenzy at all for sure and I'm about to put it over there this is actually my other ferment the video is on top here above if you want to see this one it's actually the ferment d10 pfp power distributor extender it's actually an extender that I'm gonna pull after afterwards because you can see right there I have a mess over there there's no protection at all it's just some protection over here. but for this is the on the back has all the outlets they all have uh, individually set so if one breaks the other one is not broken with the electricity passage going on there and also has the regulation the 120 back and made actually this actually made in China developing the US one of the best things that I think so you can actually purchase this item because look at it, it's a beautiful item it's gonna protect all of your gear but mostly I got it because my gear is it cheap it's like around 18 to 19 thousand dollars and I want to protect my gear so what I get I get this item that it cost me six hundred and seventy 
$79.99 in sweet water. You can actually go and purchase, purchase it. And actually one that I'm mostly the middle top of the model. The lower model, I don't think so suggest for you to purchase the one that costs like a hundred bucks. Uh, the Furman MX-8, let's say the DX-15. We're gonna be able to talk about that later, but now we're gonna turn it on. It has like a two second reboot right there to actually calculate how many voltage is coming from the firming to your actual speakers or your audio gear so it just takes a little bit of time so all you just need to do is just wait and see as uh, we're just waiting right here okay there we go uh mine is actually 125 believe it or not um i would like it to be 120 but it's actually 125 and on the green zone so it's, it's okay it's protected still 125 is still okay but i digitally you want it 120 because in the us it's 120 with all different gears and all gears alike uh so if you want to protect all of your gear get it of 120 uh, lower than 115 or more than 125 it's, it's not too uh, digital but on the green zone you want to stay in the green zone pretty much and this is actually not the outlet i'm going to connect it to i'm going to connect it to the studio one right there so this is uh, just on the side by my stairs please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also turn on notifications for more videos like this if you like this video please uh put a thumbs up and comment below until the next one bye